Fruity Delay is a delay plugin with easy settings, different modes and some handy presets. To open it up you might need to go here to the more plugins section and then look here for Fruity Delay. Here it is, double click on it on your selected track. Let's listen to the default effect. First without it and now with. You can clearly hear the echo but we can tweak this. Right here we have the input. This sets the volume level of the input signal. The feedback on the other hand sets the amount of delay. More feedback equals longer echoes. Setting this value at maximum causes echoes to not fade out. The cutoff right here sets the cutoff frequency for the low pass filter used on the echoes. Set to maximum to disable this feature as is. The tempo here changes the tempo between the echoes. Auto uses the default, but you can change this however you like but I like to leave this at auto for, uh, for most of the time at least. The steps here determine the amount of time between each echo. More means longer time between the echoes. Default is at three notes. Here we have the notes. The normal mode processes the stereo signal as the original, as we hear now, but then we see here inverse stereo. Inverse swaps to the right and the left channel for all the echoes. And then you come here to ping pong. This creates a bouncing effect for the left and the right channel if your uh, sound contains spent sounds. There are also some uh, cool presets you can try. For example, double attack. See, double attacks. Uh, the low pass right here. But I like to EQ it like this. Then single echo. Sometimes you only want to hear it once, so this preset may uh, work for you. And you can also go random, but I wouldn't recommend it. This is more ambient. Or I like to have here at default, set the feedback a little bit and play with this knob most of the time. And then here you can change how much effect or how little effect you want also. So play with it around, I hope this helps and this is for me the easiest way to add fruity delay or some delay inside of my project and my sounds.